Hi YouTube, I'm here because I want to have a um a little talk. Um, I have a, I have a um a video is uploading to YouTube because I did my um haul. It's part one and part two, and I, I did not edit it at all because I didn't feel like it, and I know that's sad. But I just want to do a, a little talk. You go hear my um TV because I'm watching Hulu, Hulu, and I can't find. Oh wait, here we go. I'm gonna turn, turn my TV down some so you won't hear it as much. But um, I just wanna talk to you and um give you some updates on me. Cause I have not been making any videos lately. It seems like I've been wanting to make videos so bad. Like I, I watch YouTube to get a fire to 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 do it. But and when I, when I get to dry to do it, I get ready. I get set up. Then nothing. Like I just don't have no energy. Like I have no oomph. Like it's just sad because it's like I love making videos. Like I love YouTube. Like I met friends, you know, and I have no drive to do nothing. Like all I do is stay in bed. That's all I do. Like you know, I have so many projects that I have in my head that I want to 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 do. You know, I buy these things because I want to do stuff. And to show you my creativities and my my passion, you know, and it's like I just cannot get out this hole. It's like a dark hole, and I did make an effort. I did make a step that I I am seeking help for it. I'm going to see a, a counselor. I'm going to go every two weeks ago. After I go next week on the 17th. So, and I had my first session this um last, this, this past Tuesday. And I enjoyed it. I got a lot, I got a lot of emotions out and stuff. So, I was happy that I had somebody to, to listen to me. And he... It's a guy, because I feel comfortable talking to a guy, so I, I don't feel weird or uncomfortable or nothing like that. So I enjoy him, and I feel like he, he's going to help me, and, you know, it's crazy because, um... It's so deep, like, it's so deep, it hurts so bad, like, I cry about everything, you know, I'm not happy, I hate my living situation, and I couldn't even enjoy life, I, I couldn't even enjoy my new dog that I got this past summer, you know, like, I can even enjoy him, and I love him so much, I love all my animals so much, you know, I used to record them every week, every day, and I don't record my animals at all, I don't know, it's like it's hard. I don't like I don't like my roommate at all, cause she's mean. 
she don't respect me, you know, and I try so hard to help her, you know. I am glad she, she's leaving. She's getting off my leash. And I don't care who see this. I don't care who think of this. Cause it's the truth. I don't. I don't like her at all. Cause when 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 you try so hard to help somebody, and you want them to be successful in life, and they don't. Take the knowledge what you take the knowledge that you're trying to give them. She don't help me. She don't even ask, "Do you need this or do you want this or do you need to talk?" And you know what? Every time she want to talk, I'm right there. I listen to her, even though I don't want to, and I listen to her. I give her advice. She using my iPhone. She using my computer. You know. But she treats me like crap. She treats my dog like crap. You know what I'm saying? I you know what? I don't care. You don't have to like my dog, okay? At all. I don't care. But I'll be done if I allow you to treat my dog like crap, and she do. I don't like it. And I've been sitting here being quiet. I've been quiet. And I'm getting tired of being quiet. You know? I'm like my aid. She's my aid. She's my friend. She's my everything because she takes care of me. I don't like the way she treats her. And really for her, she won't even be here. She'll be stuck somewhere. She won't even help her out, like, like she should, you know, and it's sad. I don't understand people, you know, how can you treat somebody so horrible, so mean. I, I, I just want her out of my house. And once she's on my, once she's off my leash, she's never coming back. And I don't care if she be stuck. I don't care if she need help. I uh, no. Cause I can't take it. I don't like being around drama. I don't like being around mean people. I don't, cause I have a heart, and my heart is so huge. And people take advantage of it. And I just want to let, like, uh, I feel like I could talk to y'all. You know, I feel like y'all, y'all understand and stuff. Even though I only have a little, I have 37 subscribers, I don't care. I appreciate every person who, who, who watched me, you know. And I hope I teach people out there, you know. Even if, even if I don't record, but I promise I'm going to try my hardest to do my best to get out this hole because it's, it's so deep. It's like, it's like a black hole. I just cannot get out, you know. And that's what I told my mom, you know. I told her how I feel, but I... Sometimes I can't talk to her because she don't, she don't let, let me talk sometimes, and so I'll just let her talk. I don't try to, like, squeeze words in and stuff, but anyway, but definitely going on with me, and I just want to say apologize, I just want to apologize, you know? For me not showing my face and not showing my ugly, ugly attitude and me being happy and, you know, and I'm not going to pretend, you know, because pretending is not good, lying is not good, so.
but when I'm trying my hardest to get back to me, to get back having fun and getting back going out and stuff, because I love going out, but it's like I don't have friends that I can hang out with. I have a van. It took me a long time to get my van, and I finally got a van. And my van is sitting in, in the parking lot, not being used. Not being used. Paying for insurance for what? And it's not pay, not being used. But they have to find some more insurance, cause the person I got on my policy, he won't send his information in so I could take him off my policy. It's like everything is just too much for me to handle. And I don't know how to put it together no more. Don't know how to fight no more. It feels like I'm giving up on life. That's what it feels like. I'm giving up on life. I apologize, but it's like I work so hard to get to this point. I work so hard to get to this point, and it's like I'm wasting it because I want to get out this hole. I believe in God. You know, I believe in God. Nick, things happen for a reason. You know, I'm patient. You know, I know He's gonna help me. You know, I have to help myself too. I just don't know how to help myself no more. You know, I have, when I went to, I had so many goals to do this year, like, get a service dog, you know, because I believe me having a service dog will help me out a whole lot, you know, to, I could get back out there, having fun, you know. I mean, and I'm not, I'm, I'm not saying why me, cause that's not me, cause I know other people are going through the same thing, you know, and I'm not the only one feeling like this, I'm not the only one going through this, you know, I just want help, that's all. I need help. But I don't want to make this video a long video, but I don't want to let you guys know what been going on with me. And this is not me, you know. It's not me, it's not Tweak a Cheek, it's not me. I'm a happy person, I'm always having 
a big smile on my face. Like, I let me have no smile on my face at all. So, but, and anyway, I do have, I do have a video, um, part one and part two on my haul, you know, so that'll be up soon. Or well, actually, maybe up before this video, but, you know, you could go back and watch it again, you know, but, I mean, my goal is to look for you too, because I'm tired of struggling, I'm tired of waiting on social security if you want, you know, that's not a living. I mean, it's, I just want to show people who I am, you know, like, I got big dreams, I got big dreams, I got. Just want to show people that it doesn't matter if you're in a wheelchair or whatever you had going on, it doesn't matter. You had to show you. You had to believe in yourself, you know? You had to fight. And me, I'm fighting. But I need help to fight this. I call it a black hole. It's a deep black hole. And it's getting deeper and deeper and deeper. To the point that I feel like I'm just going to give up. And I don't want to give up at all. Because I would disappoint a lot of people. And that's why I feel like too. I feel like I'm disappointing a lot of people, you know. But I don't know. But sorry for this flying. I've been so emotional lately, but nothing going on with me and stuff. So um, I hope everyone had a nice weekend. And, and I'll see you in the next one. Like always, peace and love. Bye.